Greetings, cats and kittens. If this is your first time here, welcome. And if you are returning, welcome back to Libby's Lullabies. Today, I am going to be reading Bigfoot Wants a Little Brother, written by Samantha Berger and Martha Brockenbrough, illustrated by Dave Pressler. So I want you guys to sit back or lie down. Either way, enjoy the story. Hmm. Ever since he could say the words little and brother, Bigfoot dreamed of having one. He told Mama Foot, he told Papa Foot, I want a little brother. He told the whole town. Bigfoot had big plans for the two of them. They would play hide and seek they would play feetball. They would make big forts and they would burp the alphabet. Mm. Impressive. One day, Mama Foot and Papa Foot told Bigfoot some big news. We're having a baby. A brother, a brother, a brother! Bigfoot cheered. A brother, a brother, a brother! Woohoo! But when the baby came home, it wasn't a brother. It was a sister. Her name was Bay. Bigfoot was bummed out big time. Luckily, he had an idea. If I can't have a brother, I will build one instead. He will be my robot brother. Robot. Robot. I like that, robot. Bigfoot used garbage can, vacuum cleaner, skateboard, broken egg beater, two gloves, lucky hat, salad bowl, whole jug of glue, and everything in the toolbox. He put it all together and turned it on. Bumpkiss! Robot didn't work. So, Bigfoot tinkered, he tightened, he tweaked. Bumpkiss! Again! Bigfoot worked and worked. They watched and watched. Finally, Bigfoot had Robot all figured out. He adjusted the final piece and it flew out and bonked him on the noggin. I mean, what did he expect? That's it! I quit! Building a robot can't be done. Bigfoot is out. But Bay wasn't. She fiddled with the fizz banger just a little. And kapow! Robot did not sputter, cough, wheeze, or splork. He beep blopped, bweedled, ededled, ebeep. Robot was alive. Bigfoot said. And it's all because I have a sister. Bigfoot and Bay had the best time together. They played hide and seek. Robot could not find them. They played feetball. Even though Robot didn't have feet. They built big forts. In many ways, Bay was even better than the baby brother of his dreams. But when it came to burping the alphabet, <laughs> Robot had them both beat. <laughs> oh, well, it was a lot of fun. 
I love Samantha Berger. She's so funny. You guys probably saw me fighting with my glasses, huh? My son's puppy. Anyway, sometimes you may want one thing, you get something else, and it turns out even better than you thought. I want you guys to enjoy the rest of your day or your evening, your week or your weekend, and I will see you next time on Libby's Lullabies. Cheers.